Hi, my name is Lee. I'm a product manager at Gardner Bender, and today I'm going to be talking about our fuse puller and continuity tester, uh, one of our newest, most innovative tools. Um, so a fuse is an electrical safety device that provides overcurrent protection um, on a circuit. It has a little metal uh, wire inside that will basically melt when there's too much current that flows through the fuse um, in order to protect the device that the fuse is being used with uh, from being damaged. Uh, so a good fuse will have continuity in it, uh, whereas a bad fuse won't have continuity, uh, which basically means that there's no complete path for current to flow through. Um, so this tester will basically test if the fuse has continuity or not. Um, typical applications of a fuse would be in automotive applications, uh, but more specifically to this tool, um, in circuit boards, uh, circuit breakers, uh, as well as in electrical test devices such as multimeters or clamp meters. So the specs of this uh, fuse puller and tester, uh, it's designed specifically for 0 to 200 amp and 250 volt fuses, as well as 0 to 100 amp and 600 volt fuses. Uh, it will work with 3 8 inch to 1 and 1 8 inch diameter cartridge fuses specifically. Um, class C, C, G, H, J, K, R, and T fuses. Uh, it's made from a tough insulated plastic, so it'll withstand being dropped or crushed. It's got non-slip serrated grips on the sides, so it's easy to grip without slipping out of your hand. Um, it's also a nice compact lightweight design as well, so it's easy to carry around or slip in your pocket uh, when you're on the go. Um, so the way this tester works is there's the tester in the middle here. All you do is touch the fuse to one end and your finger to the back end of the tester and the LED will light up green if it's a good fuse. Um, so that'll tell you that there's continuity in the fuse and it, it'll work on any device that you can get to. Um, if this LED doesn't light up, then you know that the fuse is bad. And there's also the fuse removal portion of the tool. Um, to do that, I have a small meter here that I'll show you. How it works, you just kind of squeeze the fuse until it slides out. So it's a real nice way to remove the fuse from a device uh, if it's kind of a cramped space that your fingers can't fit into, for example. Um, if you ever need to replace the battery on the fuse, it is powered by two LR44 uh, button cell batteries. Um, so all you do is you slide out the little test device in the middle here, and then you can open this up to replace the two batteries and then just slide it right back into the tool when you're done um, to continue to use.